Hello everyone, welcome back to Command and Conquer Red Alert. Welcome to the fourth Soviet mission. And this time we're going to attack Germany. So let's take the northern road first, as usual. Good work dealing with that spy. You please, Stalin. Make sure you never disappoint him. Now, I have a special task for you. We are amassing for our attack on Berlin. The Allies are aware of this, so we are going to... How do they say? Throw them a bone? I want you to create a diversion. Occupy their troops until we can drop soldiers behind their lines. Once the troops are in, use the soldiers to cut off Allied communications. With no early warning. We can take Berlin by surprise. So, here we go. And we finally got an MCV, so let's speed up a little bit. And let's build our base. So we've got a V-launcher here, and we also have Soviet heavy tanks. They're pretty much like the Allied medium tanks, except better, because they have two barrels. And they're pretty much the best unit, in my opinion, they're like the best basic unit. You can also build mammoth tanks later on, but to be honest, they're way more they're way more slow, they, they're easier to hit because they're larger, they're also more expensive, so I, I generally prefer those heavy tanks. So let's just explore a little bit. And uh, we, we seem to have a lot of building space here. I appreciate that. So. And four heavy tanks should also keep you safe for the remainder of the mission. So, heavy tanks are more expensive than medium tanks. They cost nine hundred fifty dollars instead of seven hundred dollars. But the money to value ratio is way better with these tanks here. So, let's get radar right down. Let's get even more heavy tanks. Here we are. Could build a service depot or maybe yeah, let's build barracks. Let's maybe get a couple of defenses. These V-launchers are very slow, but they have very good range. I think they are in fact the land vehicle that has the best range. And they are also pretty good against everything that doesn't fly, so they kill infantry with one hit. Ooh, buildings. And they... they look at that. Oh, is that the healing crate? Yeah, looks like that. So didn't really need that, but never mind. If you want, you can position a unit next to it and then heal your units later on while you're on an offense. So... Ooh, pillboxes are cute. Yeah, you really notice the difference between these guys and the medium tank is so much better. Oh, look at, take a look at that. That's actually not good at all, so stop that. Stop attacking my harvesters. That goes for you too. Oh, they almost killed one of my harvesters. That's disappointing. What? Why? Oh, yeah, I don't have money. Huh? So, oh yeah, I was I was rambling about how awesome these tanks are. So, yeah, here we go. Thank you very much for that money. So let's get a flamethrower. And the flamethrower, I mean flame tower. Oh, more more of these guys here. Take a look at that. So, oh, bazooka guys. Yeah, bazooka guys. They are still pretty good against tanks, but they have been nerfed quite a bit. In fact, I think they kind of suck in this game. So, medium tank. Not a chance against a mess of heavy tanks. So, where are you going, light tank? Well, I don't really care. So, let's get a repair, repair bay. And by repair bay, I mean service depot, because it's called differently in this game. And let's repair my tank. Oops. Let's repair my tanks. So, uh, don't really need a whole lot of firepower for this mission. So, if you really want to, you can just 
build some like 10 tanks and probably kill the allies, but I don't want to risk losing the battle because that's annoying because then we have to rebuild. So yeah. Hello, light tanks. So here we go. These flame towers, they're pretty good against infantry. They're not all that good against armor. So. As the first time I played this game, I didn't really pay attention to the unit sprites because they were so huge and pixelated. And I wondered why my allied tanks were so much weaker than the Soviet tanks. It's because they're not the same tanks. Yeah, they're sending up, oh, they're sending quite, quite some stuff against me. Wow, almost, almost destroyed my fan tower. No rocket guys, really? Get lost. You guys too. Well, they, they are sending in a lot, lot of rocket guys. Hello. So you guys please repair yourself. You need repairs too, especially you. And I still wish repair was a little bit faster. So you got you were already repaired but then you got damaged again, so yeah here we go. You stay here and defend my base. There we go. And now I want you repaired. And I want more heavy tanks. Oh, light tank and all kinds of other stuff. Stuff. Come on, just die. So here we go. Wow, they are sending in quite some stuff. I didn't remember them being that aggressive, but then again, it doesn't really matter. Oh, hello. Everybody, get over here and kill these rocket guys. So, and oh, war collector. Let's make them angry. This is just melting away. And there's their base already. I think they have these gap generators that only the allies get. And they generate Shroud of War. So, yeah, it's pretty annoying, but it doesn't really affect the AI because the AI cheats and doesn't really. What are you, what are you guys doing? Anyway, so the AI cheats and doesn't really have Shroud of War, the AI can always see the entire map, so because the computer is a cheating bastard, so. Okay, I lost more stuff than I thought I would lose, and the wife is still standing. Doesn't really matter, let's destroy their buildings. So, man. So they were, uh, they were building those towers, but man, just get lost. I should be out of money now. So, or maybe not. Anyway, let's destroy the construction yard, so... Yeah, they should do it. Okay, this was not too difficult, but slightly more difficult than I remembered it to be. Probably because I attacked relatively early. Well, not super early, but relatively early. Let's destroy... This and let's destroy my barracks, so... So here we go. So let's move over here first. And let's destroy the arms factory, just in case I still have money somewhere. Man, these technicians, they're so difficult to hit. There we go. Oh, they're so fast. Oh, more tanks. So, and there's more guys coming for me, but it doesn't really matter. So, and lost my V-launcher, doesn't really matter. And why? Oh, yeah. Here we go. So, wow. How about you fight back or something? Did, oh, I seriously just lost all my tank there. Well, that's disappointing. 
What? Come on. Come, give me a break here. Okay, I'm handling this. I'm way too lax here. I'm like, yeah, this is just fourth mission. Nothing can happen. And then, then this happens. So. Did they destroy one of my orc? Oh, come on, they didn't seriously destroy one of my orc collectors. Okay, this is, this is terrible. Yeah, they did, otherwise I wouldn't have this technician here, so... Man. This is terrible. So... Yeah, I guess the message here is don't underestimate the AI, even in earlier missions. Anyway, let's move over here. And explore this area here. So... There we go. So, focus fire. Destroy barrels. Here we go. These things, they always seem to have power. Whether or not you have power or not. So here we go. Okay, so they're caught in more reinforcements, so... I want to destroy their radar dome first because their radar, at least their secondary radar, is what allows them to call in reinforcements. You harvest here, so so here we go. And yeah, those jeeps aren't really a problem. Oop, power plants. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I have to go this way, where I should have gone first, but didn't. Never mind, I still got this. So you join those guys. Let's destroy this harvester, even though I can't really do anything anymore. Here we go. So let's move north. And let's build more tanks. And how about you destroy this power plant here? Oh, medium tank. And it's dead. So... And... Oh yeah. They use this this radar dome here to call in reinforcements, so... If you want to have a slightly easier time, destroy it first. Yep. Objective complete, destroyed all our demons. And oh yeah, ob objective 1 is completed, there's no objective 2. So, yeah, and then... I would, I would even say the majority of force the Allied get, get here are, what are you doing, are reinforcements, so you might want to destroy that first. Unlike I, what I did, so yeah, never mind. So you guys get over here, otherwise this will take forever. And yeah, this should pretty much be it. So, let's just pop a save here. Here we go. Kill this guy here. And there we go. Yeah, again, not really that difficult, but I suggest you maybe take a little more time or really destroy that radar first. Yeah, I was a little bit too aggressive and then there was that one situation where I didn't pay attention to my tanks and it just got um, shot to bits because they weren't defending themselves. Which is disappointing, but unfortunately how this game works. So that was the first version of the fourth Soviet mission and I shall see you next time. Take care and goodbye.